our application is ready we're going to test it register and I'm going to register with the teacher test teacher at gmail.com then I'm going to okay that's supposed to be my email address then my password password and I'm going to select the role of a teacher and create account so now you can see this has gone to the teacher homepage and if I go for the logout I'm gonna log out and select the student role this time and I'm going to just say a three I'm going to add one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and I'm going to give it a full name. I'm going to give, give it stood, create account, and then here we have the student homepage. So that's how you would do this arrow for your application. You can do this for as many rows as possible. Then you begin to use conditional. Um, then you begin to use conditionals to make sure that things are shown to another user based on the setting conditions so that's basically how you do it hope you enjoyed this video feel free to leave a like and don't forget to subscribe if you want to learn more about flutterflow and other no code tools click on the link below if you want to get if you want to learn if you want to learn more about flutterflow feel free to check out my flutterflow mastery course it's over there it's going to teach you everything you need to know about flutterflow to get you started from zero to one and you want to work with me click on the link below also and you'll be able to book a call with me and we'll work together thank you i'll see you in another lesson thank you